basically what I do is I, I study patterns and phenomena, um, you know, described using mathematics, so described using numbers and, and equations and so forth, but uh, often describing actually real world things. Once uh, someone came to me with a sort of a, a weird numerical puzzle, they're trying to process MRI scans and they found a way to get higher resolution images out of less data. And so they could actually get very high quality medical images from, from very short scans, uh, but they couldn't explain why this worked. And so they, they came to me and we turned it into a math problem and, and it was, it was, we had to solve a bunch of equations. Um, and we found, we found an explanation as to why this worked. Um, and in fact, because of this, now um, all the, um, the, the latest generation of MRI machines, they, they use our algorithms to actually uh, improve the, the quality of images. And, and now MRI scans that used to take several minutes, they, they can now just take 30 seconds. So you can take real world problems and sort of distill them to almost like puzzles, solving lots and lots of equations, which is something I, I enjoy doing a lot. So when I was uh, younger, I would spend a lot of my time doing this, this math research, solving these, these math problems. Nowadays, I find myself doing more um, mentoring and on committees. And uh, as you get more senior, you're more responsible for, for junior people. But that's also very satisfying in, in, in a different way. I think there's a lot of phobia of maths uh, that people think that it's, it's something that like only uh, really strange wizards do or something like it's, 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 it's like these maths uh, equations seem like magic spells sometimes. And actually, um, a lot of the way we think about mathematics is actually coming from just, just real world, you know, uh, common sense uh, intuition. Mass phobia is, is this, this, this serious thing, you know? So, you know, I, I go to a party and I introduce myself and you know, people ask, so, so what do you do for a living? And I say, I'm a mathematician. Uh, and this, this leads to one of two things usually. So, so, so either uh, the competition just sort of dies it's, um, or, uh, you know, or, or they say, oh, I was, I was terrible at maths. But you know, as you keep talking to, to, to people, we have common interests. You can talk about sports or politics or, or something else. And you know, we're, 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 I'm, uh, you know we're, we're human too. Well, there are, there are many paths to uh, be a good academic. I mean, uh, it is true that, that there are people like myself who we, we skipped a lot of grades and we kind of went very fast at the beginning. But there are also many good academics uh, that I know of, you know, who, who came to the subject late in life, um, uh, they, they took a break to, you know, to work, you know, sometimes in industry or, or to have a family or something. Um, when you're in school, uh, some of the focus is, is, is a lot on grades. There's often a lot of emphasis on, on, on being very fast and getting the top grades. But the actual research and so forth, it's, it's, it's a much longer term thing. And, uh, you know, uh, like good ideas and so forth, they can take years to develop properly. And sometimes having a mature perspective with experience of, of an unusual background can actually give a perspective that, that people who've sort of raced through their education didn't. So, you know, I mean, just because you didn't get first place in a competition or something, it, it doesn't mean like somehow your, your entire career track is, 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 is ruined. Um, I mean, as, as, as long as, as uh, you're, you feel like you're learning and you're making connections and, and you're, you're, uh, people, if you're, you, you find that you're in a community that you feel like you belong, um, you know, you'll eventually make, it, make a good contribution. Mm -hmm.